Hey guys, what is going on? So today we're going to be talking about the latest news from the iPhone 5S. Okay, so now as it's uh, getting towards the end of August, a lot of stuff has been hyped up about when Apple is going to be talking about the iPhone 5S. As of right now, they're expected very, very soon to be uh, releasing information on it. Approximately, they're saying on September 10th, there will be a special event where they will be releasing information on the iPhone 5S and iOS 7 and possibly some more devices. And as most of you know now, the next generation iPhone is most likely going to be called the iPhone 5S. Although it is just a small upgrade from the iPhone 5, it'll have some notably better features. First of all, it'll be keeping the uh, new 4-inch screen that was introduced with the iPhone 5, but it may have have some better resolution. The official build of iOS 7 will be pre-installed on the device and this will be a first time ever a bigger capacity of up to 128 gigabytes. Now that is not 100% confirmed but it's been rumored and a lot of sources say it is going to happen and I would imagine it probably will. Also being introduced is the new dual LED flash with a higher camera resolution. The A7 chip processor, which is going to be a huge upgrade, um, and if you go all the way back to like A4 devices, this is going to be insane doing a comparison between these two. And for the first time ever, they are rumored to be introducing it in three or more different colors including white, black, and gold. And a lot of people have been really, really interested in the biometric fingerprint scanner. Towards the middle of the beta releases for iOS 7, there was a new option um, showing that there may possibly be a fingerprint scanner um, added into this device. Now, it's not 100% confirmed that there will be, um, but there are a lot of sources saying that it probably will, um, but uh, I'm not too sure about it. It's possible, but it's, again, not 100% confirmed. Now, seeing as they're probably going to be adding the 128 gigabyte model, the pricing may change just a little bit. The 16 gig model is rumored to start at $199. The 32 gig for $299, the 64 for $399, and the 128 for $499. Now again, this is just a rumor and this is just uh, an estimate of how much it may cost. It is not 100% confirmed, but again, it is very likely that that will happen and there's probably going to be in the general price range. And before we head out today, big shout out to Like a Boss 256 Alright, well that's all I have for you guys today. Please like and sub and follow me on Twitter at JB underscore iPhone 5. I'll be doing lots more videos um, coming up to when the iPhone 5S will be released. And when it is released, I'm going to be camping out for it, doing unboxing videos, reviews, comparisons. It's going to be legit. So make sure you're following me and subscribed so you can stay up to date. Peace.